Hey guys, Jeff here from HireTrustMarketing.com. Hey, I thought I would share with you today, I was on a coaching call this morning with our members over at InfoMarketerZone.com and they kind of asked me, what were the three things, if you could help me get over the hump, that would be most valuable to me, you know, in each of their businesses? And I'd say there's, there was about 14 people on the call this morning on an inner circle call for that membership site. And, you know, I had to, I had to think about it, but it, it came down to these three things. And it literally changed my life. When I was in my early 20s, see, I, I had a very different mindset. I was number one, and, and this leads me to my number one thing that changed my life, and it's the acknowledgement that I needed to grow as a person. See, back then, I was, I was very concerned over what other people thought. Um, I had very low ambition, very low visions for what my life could turn out to be. See, I came from a community where most of the people, if they in fact stayed out of trouble, that was a good life. A lot of them, you know, have either burned out in life or they're behind bars or they've done other, you know, they just ended up in a bad place. And so that's where I came from. So that's your starting point. You know, it, it doesn't take much to get up above that. And so, you know, when you're, when you're living in that kind of situation, it's hard to set the bar really high because the only bar you know is already set fairly low. Right, and so I had to learn that. I had to tune to other people. I had to, you know, this is even before the YouTube uh, generation. So I had to read a lot of books. I had to read a lot of autobiographies. I learned from people at seminars. I went to events because that's where I learned about this whole other world that was possible. And I knew that, you know, the bar could be set much higher for myself. And as soon as I knew that, then that created the desire, the vision, the goal and the hope in my life that I could actually get to that higher level. And then I started working on things like self-confidence and, and being able to communicate effectively with other people, which is an important part. And so the whole, the first thing that really can change your life is understanding where you are today, learning how you can rise the bar. Who can you look to? Who can you, who can you discover that has a much bigger vision and much bigger life have achieved great things that you can learn from be inspired by be motivated by and if you follow those people and it starts to you'll notice that just by sheer osmosis you'll start to think bigger you'll start to have bigger beliefs you'll start to want more for yourself and once you have that there's no stopping you because that build that builds that desire that burning motivation and the belief and the certainty that you can actually do it too Okay, and then you work on your own skills, you work on your communication skills, you work on your planning skills, you work on your hard skills, and you gain the knowledge and the understanding and the passion and the belief in yourself and the certainty that's gonna allow you to go to the next step. So the second thing, and, and that becomes a lifelong quest by the way, that's not just something that you do for a week or a month or even a year, it becomes a life, a way of living that incorporates learning and lifelong improvement into every single day. And if, I would say I do that more than ever, even though I've achieved levels that I could never imagine in my life. Now, I couldn't have imagined 10 years ago or 20 years ago, I'm working harder than ever on improving myself because I know what it can do. I know the results it can pay. I know the results it can pay in my business life. I know the results it can pay in my own emotional situation. I know the, the results it can pay in my, in, to my family and to my friends it's well worth the effort. It may seem selfish to some of you now, but the more time you put into yourself and improve yourself, improve your discipline, improve your passion, improve your goals, improve your, your own skills and communication skills and, and how you relate to other people and how you can influence other people um, and how you can share things with other people. Incredibly important stuff and you will not go anywhere in life unless you learn those skills. That's why I'm spending a little bit more time on that one because it's so, so important. Now the second thing that I learned very early on is that you know there's everyone searching for an answer um, to questions in their life, and so to the degree that you can provide that answer, you know, and you can do that through coaching, you can do it through consulting, you can through it get just everyday advice, right? But if you can do it in a scalable way, if you can provide answers to people over and over and over again through ebooks and books and courses and videos and digital products that you spend time creating once and that you share with people over and over and over again and that you can monetize over and over and over again, then you've got 
you know, as close to thing, I don't like the word passive income, but you've got as close to at least leveraged income, if not passive income, as you can get these days, right? Because, you know, there's nothing like being able to put your time in once, create something that's of value, and then, you know, um, be able to sell it over and over again to that market. Okay, so you've cut out the cost of creating it, it, you know, and, and giving up time for money, which is what happens in getting coaching and consulting. So we've helped a ton of people that have had 15, 20 year old coaching, consulting, personal training, chiropractic, any type of you know, one-on-one -on -one, um, business where they share their knowledge with people and just being able to package it and sell it to people, package it once and sell it over and over again has freed people up geographically. They can now move to different cities where they couldn't before. Um, it, it, it frees them up from an emotional point of view because they don't have to suck up all of their time, their 12 or 14 hours a day coaching, consulting people. They can do it once and then sell that product over and over again. So it's a very, very powerful method for monetization, for sharing you know, how you help people, for sharing your cause and for making money obviously because you know creating once selling over and over again a lot of these courses can be created within two to four weeks launched and if you hit um actually I'll, I'll leave a link in the in the comments below um but if you're on instagram seeing this or seeing a clip of this it'll be in my bio but we have a free four-part course that will take you through exactly how what you need to do to be able to share your knowledge share your learnings share most of you have something in your heads today or experience in your life that you can share with other people to help improve their life to get your first product out the door. I would say 99% of you have that capability, have that kind of knowledge, at least 80% of that knowledge already, and maybe you have to fill in a few blanks to get your product out, but literally you have that knowledge that you can start selling to people today. Okay, so, you know, digital products, being able to create products which have your name on it that you can brand that mean you're not having to sell someone else's product. You're not having to do a job where you're working at someone else's company. You start a business with a product that is yours, that has your name on it, that you can get out into the marketplace and that you can build an army of salespeople, either hire those salespeople or just affiliates that you recruit to sell your product for a commission. It's so dead easy and it's how the internet is built. It's how the internet is meant to be used. E-commerce platforms support this great. Okay, so you can build a business like this in literally two to four weeks. That's what we help people through, infomarketerzone.com. Um, but I'll put a link down below to the free training so at least you can see that, you can see what the business is involved, and then you can understand whether this is for you, and you can know, in fact, you know, with that free program, we've had people create their own first product, get it out the door, and start changing their life just based on the free product alone. Okay, and then the third tip I would give you is learning and, and this is from my personal experience is learning that you know go, having a vision beyond just a micropreneur that means I always thought that you know the best business would be one where I didn't have any employees where I didn't hire anybody where I could do everything myself and that was that got me a long way that got me to the point where I understood how to run a business I understood how to get a product at the door I understood how to market it I understood how to make my first six-figure income with my own product what it didn't help me with is how I can even build, I can scale that further. I can build a system, I can build a process, I can build a team that can, you know, get word out much, much wider. I can get products built faster. I can get, um, you know, I can get armies of salespeople much, much quicker. I can get publicity quicker. I can build my message and get it out much, much further than I could ever do it alone. And that takes understanding and a belief in other people. It takes understanding how to hire people. It, you know, whether those are part-time people, those are contractors, or whether they're full-time people, you know, we've got all three now around the business. And I never, if you had asked me 10 years ago if I was gonna run that kind of business, no, I was gonna do it all myself. And it was small thinking. You know, when I started to, to earn the six figures with my own products, and then I saw other people that were even above me and I saw how they built systems, they built processes, they built companies and they built an army of people that were out for their cause and helped them expand, you know, not just 10x but 100x. They could get the message out further, they could get more products built, they could build more momentum um, it, and it just built a whole cause and, it, and by the way it helped all those people because it employed people and they got behind the cause and they learned how to do this and some of them eventually go off and do it on their own and that's okay. You know, that's a nice legacy to have, 
is five years out to know that, hey, you've, lo you've maybe lost three people, but those people have gone out and built companies of their own. Imagine that, right? You're doing well, your own business, but you've also empowered other people to do the same thing. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty amazing legacy to leave. So I hope those three things were useful. So work on yourself, get your own act together, get your own beliefs, and then build up your skills and build up your belief and build up everything you need to go out in the market and dominate. Number two, build your own products. Don't just get by selling other people's products. And I'm gonna put a link down below that will convince you that you can do it and it will tell you and get you started on your very first product. And number three, don't be so small-minded to think you're gonna do it all by yourself, right? Nobody does this by themselves. You build a team and you start building a team today. You start building contacts, you start building students, you, you get videographers to help you with content, you get graphics design people to help you with graphics, you get um, content people to help you build products, you get sales people that know how to sell your product and market your product, okay? So all that will lead you to success. Those are the three things I can look back over the last 25 years and, and point out clearly as a differentiation of what led to more success than not. Those are clearly the three leading things. So hope you found that valuable. If you do, would love to hear your comments down below. You know, maybe what area do you need to work on? Or is there another area I missed that maybe you guys are yeah, found is, is, are big in your life? But let me hear your comments. And if you find this valuable, share it with your users. I know that it's a, it's a story that, you know, a lot of people need to hear. And uh, beyond that, we'll be back at you very soon, guys. Um, love and respect all you guys. I know every one of you can be what you want to be and more. You just need to get started. You need to have the belief. And I know in, you know, a few weeks to, to a few months, you can be much further than what you've even dreamed. Okay? Have an awesome day, guys.